Welcome to the 114th annual meeting for your Jackson County Chamber of Commerce and of course the second annual Night of Distinction. Um, thank you. Woo, good evening. Like I'm extremely honored to accept the 2022 Albert Earl Ambassador of the Year Award tonight. Thank you to the amazing ambassadors who sit on the committee with me for electing me, especially Tessa Simmons and Joe Sharp who lead us and Deanna Light, Molly Bolton and Tim Baer who have shaped this committee over the last 20 plus years and guided us to be the best. I have been an ambassador for 13 years and would very much like to recognize the women of our community who have paved the way for me during my journey. Mindy Bradish Orta, Melissa Jackala, and Angela Macknick. Each of you have inspired me and encouraged me along the way and I'm grateful for you. Finally, I wanna say thank you to my family and my employer, Advance Employment, for supporting my passion to volunteer my time and putting me, and putting up with me being away from home and work. Blaine and Laura Schultz and Shelly Mitchell, co-owners of Advance Employment, have always been my biggest cheerleaders in life, both personally and professionally, and I wouldn't be here today without them. I'm looking forward to many more years supporting the Jackson Chamber and its community, and I, want you all to enjoy the rest of your evening. Thank you. And thank you for the angels who apparently nominated us. This did come as a total surprise to us uh, several weeks ago when we were told that we'd be here tonight. Uh, it's a very small and wonderful group we're joining and we've been very Grateful for the time we've spent involved with the foundation and plan to continue the rest of our time. When I was on the board, uh, it was uh, we just had reached the one million dollar mark, and we were very excited about that. But there is no, there'll be no end to it. It is for good forever, and the assets will continue to grow, but most most growing most through generosity of people like yourselves and other generous people within our community. And we have to keep supporting uh, that because we do not have the deep pockets that many other communities have with multi-hundred million dollar corporations. But we'll get there and the Community Foundation will reach that point. I don't know if we'll be around, but most of you will. So again, thank you so much. We are very honored. Um, thank you, EJ. It was a pleasure serving on the board for two years with you. Um, Thank you to the chamber. Uh, and congratulations to the other nominees. Um, it was a tough crowd this year, and we're just, we're honored to be chosen um, and really humbled. 17 years ago next month, we broke ground. Can you believe it? 17 years. <clears throat> Which means I'm old. Um, uh, but. For some of you that were there, we dedicated, in the parking lot, it was, it was simply, you know, dirt. Uh, we threw a shovel in the ground, and a lot of folks from the community came out and wished us well. And we dedicated the building and the business to the Lord, and I mean that. And all we asked for was <clears throat> a place where people could come and be safe, and team members could come and be safe and grow and go on to support this community. And he has blessed us uh, in able to, being able to do that. You know, I thank God for you guys. I thank God for this community that we're in. We, we started Production Realty. I was like a young, dumb kid. I was in my 20s. Started it in 2009. So Production Realty is a real estate office, you know, real estate firm. We do commercial real estate, residential real estate in Jackson County. And we started it in 2009. If you guys remember, this was the worst real estate market in the world ever, history of time, all that stuff. It was, it was crazy. So everybody said, you're crazy. Don't start a real estate firm. And I said, you know what? This community supports us, supports um, local, you know, local guys, right? And I feel like we can build probably the world's best real estate firm here in Jackson. And, uh, you know, because of all you guys, all of your support, all of my, our clients, um, we were able to do that. I had a pastor who once told me, stand to be seen, 
speak to be heard, and sit down to be appreciated. So I'm going to make my comments brief. It's an honor and a privilege to work in a community as great as Jackson County. I'm humbled and deeply honored to be this year's recipient of the REACH Hire Award, sponsored by Michigan Works Southeast through the Jackson County Chamber. It's truly an honor to be included in the same company of all the great past recipi recipients that have done so much to make our Jackson community a great place to live, to work, and to raise a family. I would not be here tonight without the great team we have at U.S. Staffing. They conduct business in a compassionate and professional manner each and every day. Our vision at U.S. Staffing is to be the preferred human resources partner for economic development and community prosperity. Heather and her team and everyone in our Jackson office embodies this vision and our mission by building relationships and connecting people within the Jackson community. Thank you to the Jackson Chamber for this honor, for the honor of this award. Jamie McKibben was tr a true example of someone who loved Jackson, and I'm humbled to be recognized in his company. It is a privilege to be a part of the Jackson community, and I love being able to contribute to the renaissance we are experiencing here. Jackson is a community of hardworking people with a lot of heart, and I want everyone to know how special this place is. We are a town that is proud of our history and which has an exciting future. I believe that the best way to lead is by example, and I am lucky to work with a team of creative people who help make Jackson a place we can all be proud to call home. Uh, I just, this is a huge honor. Um, thank you to the chamber, the board of directors, the committee uh, for this, and of course the amazing sponsor, True Community Credit Union. <laughs> They're really good, you should check them out. <laughs> Um, after I found out about this award, I called my husband and, I, and he said, congratulations. And then he said, so what's next? And I was like, well, just give me a minute, buddy. Just give me a minute. Um, so a little bit about the Athena. Um, a few years ago, I attended an economic club luncheon where Sherry Jones, an Athena from the Lansing Chamber, was our speaker. At that time, I was struggling with my confidence as a leader, as a mother, as a basic human. Um, I was sitting at the table when I heard Sherry's speech, and she was a complete stranger, and I still have never met her to this day. Um, and she changed my mindset, righted my direction, gave me the kick in the butt I needed to inspire a positive view of myself. Um, I'm very honored tonight. Thank you so much to receive this award. I'd like to thank the Chamber, County National Bank, and the community at Jackson for making this possible. I would also like to give a very special thank you to my family, who is not here tonight, for their continual support. My general manager and friend, Courtney Marriott, for her dedication to the success of the company, and myself, my mentor and role model, Shirley Allegre, who never stops pushing me to new limits, to all of the Keeping It Clean team that works so hard to provide not only consistent service, but also community support. And of course, to my business partner, my husband, my love, thank you for always being on my side and cheering me on to our next level.